Pakistan is facing adverse effects of climate change. The floods in Pakistan have caused havoc and devastation in Pakistan, especially in the northern regions. To understand floods in Pakistan, it is very important to understand the geography of Pakistan. According to Al Jazeera, Pakistan is home to 7,253 glaciers and most of these glaciers are located in the northern regions of Pakistan. Pakistan contains the most glacial ice outside the polar regions than any other country. The average amount of rainfall that Pakistan received in 2020 is 408.3 mm as compared to 297.6 mm of rain that we received from 1961 to 2010. Moreover, we are an agricultural country. Our agriculture sector plays an important role in the economy. For instance, in 2021, the agriculture sector contributed 18.9% to the GDP and absorbed 42.3% of the entire labor force. The floods and the rain has caused scarcity of food. According to United Nations Environment Programme, Pakistan only contributes 1% of the global greenhouse emissions. But it is among top 10 countries that are affected by the climate change. At this stage, we cannot avoid floods. But what precautionary measures should be taken to avoid this devastation? On the federal level, the government can take numerous steps. Number one, formulation of a rapid response program. Number two, ensuring adequate public accommodation, health and relief facilities. Number three, plantation. Because plantation can reduce the height of floods up to 20% in the urban areas. Number four, to avoid urban flooding, water storage tanks can be installed. Number five, Construction of water reservoirs for flood control. What can we do on an individual level? Number one, seek out to non-profit organizations and donate clothing, ration packages, sheets, comforters, anything you can to help out those in need. As a student, a learner on Nawab, I am a responsible and an active global citizen. Together, we can influence decision makers and leaders. Let us leave a good impact on this world. Climate change is real. And it's happening now. So, play your part well. Because everyone can save lives.